right now, finally leaving you with day tonight here is this very interesting story that will very soon affect you and I, maybe even our future generations. A breakthrough from Japan could rewrite emergency medicine as we know it. Scientists are developing here artificial blood that works for everyone, doesn't need matching, stays fresh without refrigeration. Now this lab-made blood mimics the real deal. It carries oxygen, clots wounds and lasts two years at room temperature. That's really a game changer compared to the one month shelf life of donated blood, real blood that flows in yours and my body. At the heart of this innovation here are teams at Nara Medical University and Chao University. Some even using expired donor blood to extract hemoglobin, packaging it into synthetic red cells that bypass the whole blood group barrier. Now with Japan's aging population and shrinking donor pool, the urgency couldn't be greater. Add to that, the need for instant transfusions is in any kind of disaster and rural, at rural hospitals particularly, or even war zones, this research at this point could really hit a vital nerve. Human trials kick off by March 2025, and the vision, of course, is to make universal, portable, life-saving blood available to all by 2030. And the space isn't off the table either. The synthetic blood could be a lifeline on deep space missions where real blood stores